met them live again. Yeah. And um. Today was pretty me. Yeah. Missing like missed an hour of it. But yeah, but it's alright. It's okay. But we'll tell you. Um, Shane McMahon started off SmackDown. This is pretty much talking how what he did, and pretty much he just uh, the whole thing is he's best in the world. He was born to it. He didn't need no tag team. He didn't need no partner. And basically, the one thing that he felt good was beating the crap out of the Miz, which. To be honest, I think a lot of people say it would be their highlight of the night is being up the Miz. Being up the Miz is good because it feels awesome. Which? And he's setting up the match for WrestleMania. Yeah. So that's what the uh, what Shane McMahon said. First match of the night: Alistair Black, Ricochet, Hardy Boys, versus Bar, Rusev, and Nakamura. Eight man tag team. It was a good match until the New Day showed up and started fight, fighting all the bad guys. Yeah. Which basically uh, made a, disqual a, a disqualification. Oh. Uh, I don't know. And then Randy Orton came out with a promo. Yeah. He's like, I have to get something on my chest. And he's just pretty much saying that this is his house. He built his house before Styles was even here. Then Styles comes out. And he's pretty much saying that Randy Orton's been babysat. He has so many people like Rated RKO, Lexi, um, Bray Wyatt. You forgot Evolution. Evolution. And then his daddy when he was Everyone. the legend killer. He goes... Um, I'm not going to be your next victim. Randy Orton retorts saying, You're not a victim, I'm the landlord. And rent's d uh, due, bitch. And uh, AJ Styles says, You want your rent? Come and get it, WrestleMania. Yeah. So, pretty much that's going to be a match. Hmm. Randy or Styles? Who would I want to win? Depends on who's got the better costume and entrance. It's a hard decision. They're both good wrestlers. Might have to think about that. Uh, AJ Styles, you saying that the rumors are he's leaving. So, and then, next match. Oscar versus Sonya Deville. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's see. Let's see what happened last Tuesday. Um, Mandy Rose tripped on the um, ring apron, which Asuka was able to win. This time... Um, Mandy Rose purposefully pulled on the uh, the um, ring apron, which ca uh, caused Sonya Deville to fall into Asuka, and she used the Asuka lock. Yep. So they trying to hype up a Sonya Deville Mandy Rose fight. Mm, we don't know. Which is basically D-list, uh, D-list. Superstar versus D-list superstar. It's it's oh it's almost like putting um what was it? You eating you put hot sauce on your tongue uh, on your tongue like ghost pe ghost pepper uh, sauce and you dip it on your tongue and then you try to eat other food. Basically, you're not gonna taste anything. You're not gonna feel anything. So it's bleh. yeah. And that man is like. Do you think this? Do you think I want to do this? And so I was like, Nah. Maybe she was thinking it and just said that. And then what was it? We had Becky Lynch Becky coming out. Lynch. It's coming out saying she's the man. She's the man. And she was playing. Um, she's playing. Uh. Oh wow! I, got, I forgot her name. I forgot. Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey. She played Ronda Rousey like a fiddle because Ronda Rousey isn't really. It's not really on my radar. Yeah. And and uh, Charlotte's just been spoon fed and handed uh, opportunities because she's Ric Flair's girl. Yeah. But she's been doing this and being the man. She's gonna go get her operation. 
so that she can be a man. Because if you're going to call yourself the man, then you need the package. Oh, boy. That way she could just come in WWE and just whip it out and say, Here, I'm going to fight you. Come on, fight me. Maybe, wait, there's the technicality. Because guys can only fight guys, but if a girl ended up getting the package, wouldn't that technically make her half guy? So technically she could fight a guy, uh, fight in men's matches? Well, N Nia Jax did. Remember when she... Yeah. Yeah. So you're saying Nia Jax is a man? <laughs> oh, no! Don't no, say no! I mean, she did go against men. Rey Mysterio and that. Oh, speaking of Rey Mysterio, is a tag team. Ray and Truth versus Samoa Joe and, um... Cien Almas. Oh. Ray yeah. won that match. He even did a double. That was awesome. Oh, yeah? Oh, explain that, Missy. He did... He freaking got knocked out. Both of them got both of them over the thing, and he freaking did a... Freaking, uh, three... What is it? Three... Six, six one nine. Six one nine to both of them. That was freaking awesome. Yeah. Yeah. And then uh, Samoa Joe was gonna do an unagi to Rey Mysterio, but Rey countered it into a via roll up pin. Vega tried to, what is her name? Vega, right? Huh? Tried to freaking cheat, and Carmella came over and grabbed her by her leg and pulled her out. Yeah. So Rey pinned Joe, so that means he's eligible for a title shot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, after the match, Joe so mad, he slammed Truth and to the ground, and then he took Cien Almas to the ground, and Ray quickly got out of the freaking ring, so he, he didn't do it to him. Yeah. And then the main event match. Kevin Owens and Mustafa Ali versus Order Rowan party. and Daniel Bryan. And party. Yeah. Oh, of course, Daniel Bryan and Rowan won. Rowan was Fickle. able to. Uh, Rowan did his face choke slam thing. To Mustafa he Ali. With the iron claw. The iron claw. Oh. It looks like the mandible claw. Uh, yeah, and then he got this thing with Vince McMahon and Kofi Kingston. The last of SmackDown. Yeah, he says that Kofi's good, but he's a joke ever since he's been with the New Day. So he. Gave, uh, uh, he gave Kofi an opportunity, so next week is a ga is Kofi a gauntlet match against... Against Randy Orton, Samoa Joe, two members of the bar. Well, both the bar. Tarver. So it's and, just the bar. And Rowan. And if he wins, he can go, he can face Daniel Bryan. Um, so I hope he wins all that gauntlet match. It's gonna be tough because Flubba Bubba is gonna be hard to take down. Yeah. Oh. And let's see, after he call, uh, he made the gauntlet match announcement, well, oh yeah, you said Randy, right? Yeah. Yeah. Everybody went into the ring to, to attack the New Day, but they stand tall. Kofi um, does the um, does his uh, kick to Cesaro, and he goes, That's gonna be you, Daniel! That's gonna be you! And then it just cuts the black right, right then and there. To, for that, what was it, Temptation show? Yeah. So it feels like there was, like, a few more minutes left. Like, a few more stuff. Because it feels like, if you're alive, you get to see everything, like, off thing, and then we don't, uh, we don't listen until, unless they put it on, like, the Facebook thing or whatever. Yeah. But that was SmackDown. Just like what? Was it on, um, what was it? On the fast lane, Rollins dropped the f bomb, but we can't hear it because apparently they edited. They knew he was gonna drop the f bomb. Yeah. <laughs> it was just like, <coughs> but I mean, SmackDown was okay. I mean, could have been a lot better. I mean, yeah, changing up a little bit. They got some new, you know. New matches or whatever, like, compared No Lacey Evans showing up. And no, only that Oscar Black and Ricochet. Only them again. And then we have the Usos just calling out all oh, the yeah. other tag team Usos. members saying, you want you, you want these tiles? Come take it from us. That was, um, 
Yeah, that's true. What did you saw on SmackDown this week? Eh. I just thought it was okay. Mm, it was alright. I mean, the SmackDown after Fastlane? Mm. Yeah. I mean, Raw stole all the hype. I mean, yeah, Raw was a little better uh, in this week than SmackDown. But we'll just see next week. Yeah, it'd mm. be better. Well, we got NXT to look forward to tomorrow. Yeah, NXT tomorrow. So, NXT's always good. So, um, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's what it's going to be like. So, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I will see you next time. Bye. Bye. Hello! Hey. And now, again, it's with 205. 205. Yeah! Yeah. Oh, man. So, pretty much this week of 205 Live was the semifinals mm -hmm. for the Cruiserweight uh, title tournament. The Girl Against Buddy Murphy's championship at WrestleMania. And yep. um, so, like I guess that was two matches mm -hmm. and a little segment backstage. Pretty much like a good guy match than a bad guy match, pretty much. Yeah. I but, was the same. Um, but that second match, man, that's that going to be intense. But yeah. uh, uh, anyway, here's the first one, right? Yeah. The first match was of the semifinals was Cedric Alexander. Yeah. For <laughs> <laughs> I like him. He's awesome. First, Oni Lorcan. Yeah. Now, just looking at this, I know Cedric Alexander was ever going to win because Oni Lorcan's in that tag team Dusty Rhodes Classic mm -hmm. tournament with um his partner. So I knew he probably wasn't going to win, which I was right. Cedric Alexander won. That match was pretty intense as well. Oh, Especially yeah. Especially with Cedric. Every time he got so close to winning, his big eyeballs yeah, popped boing. out. Boing! It was oh, like, man! Whoa, it's like, he's like he saw, hasn't seen a piece of candy in a long time. Boing! But they both did really well. Mm -hmm. But at the end, Cedric Alexander won with a lumbar check. Yep. So... And then, then there was um a little segment with Mike Canals, Maria Canals, and uh, Drake Maverick. They sound. And the Mike is just like, hey, let me talk about this. And he's like, he says he deserves better. He shows himself, blah 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 blah. And Drake's like, you're right. You know what? You're right. Next week, you're going to go against the top star of the Cruiserweight division. And one thing, losers won't cut it here. So try and make it your best next yeah. week. So next week's going to be Mike Canales versus one of the top stars. So if he loses, he might not be on Cruiserweight no more. Yeah, I wonder what he's going to be. So, bye-bye. And then the main event, the second semi-finals tournament championship title match. Yep. Tony Nice. Abjecker. <laughs> First, Drew Gulak. Loser. <laughs> they're both losers, but... But, they're both bad guys. But I'd rather have Tony Nice mm -hmm. over him. Which... They both, they both wanted this. They both they, really wanted Yeah, this. they really going at it. And Cedric Alexander was watching as he was, yeah, he was know, watching taking he, off his bandages. Because he's he's going to be going against whoever wins next week. Yeah. In the finals. Um, I don't know Buddy Murphy. He's going to watch the finals match because he he's going to want to know who he's going against. Toothpick's boyfriend. But they both had it. They both were just at it. They both were trying their hardest. Every move they could think of. Every. Anyway. And, but Joe Gulak had um, Tony Nice in the Gulak submission move. And Nice was going to the rope. Going to the rope. And he pushed the bottom rope with his foot. And flipped. And put had um, his pin. And he pinned uh, Cedric's shoulders down for the win. 
Yeah. So Tony Nice won. Ab checker won. Yeah. I'm, th th I'm telling you, this these Smash was really good. They were they I, like like she said, they, they really to the breaking point on each of them. Yeah, they were really good. They had top rope moves and all over. A lot of pins. There was a lot of um, log pins. pins like, lot, really like one, two, phew, like that. And then Cedric was so impressed, he was copping in yeah. the thing. So, um, next week it's going to be Tony Nese versus Cedric Alexander in yeah. the finals. We'll see who will go against Buddy Murphy. Yeah. Which we know Buddy Murphy's going to watch that match. Yeah. Um, but, yeah. One question. Who is your... Favorite cruiserweight superstar. Who do you like, or who would you want to see as a champion? Yeah. Hmm, me. Who? Who do I actually like in the cruiserweight? There's a lot, there's a lot of good wrestlers. I mean, I do like Cedric Alexander. Yeah, he's good. I do like Kalisto in the Lucha House Party. Lucha, 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 Lucha. I do like Akira Tawaza. Yep. Mm. He's good. Mm. I mean, I kind of like TJP, but not as yeah. much. Because I, like, I liked him in the beginning because he was a good guy and he was a fan favorite and he was the first cruiserweight champion. Um. Hmm. Tony is alright, but not a fan. Um. I don't know what I'm more that I kind of like. But, yeah. Who do you? It's hard to choose. There's, there's a lot of good wrestlers. Like, I really like Kalisto. I mean, maybe, some, maybe they should start putting girls in the cruiserweight. Yeah, that would be interesting. That would be interesting. I mean, the girls can, they can go against the cruiserweight. They're not that freaking big. I understand them trying to go against Big Show or something like that. I mean, I can go against Big Show. She got that weight. But, like, it could be girls. Like, I could see Bailey and Sasha going against the Cruiserweight. Mm -hmm. Go for that title. Can't you? I, I can. It's hard to say. We never know. But, um, what did you thought of this week or two? If I thought, I thought it was, I actually thought it was good. Because of the main, that one. Yeah, that main event one. I mean, yeah. uh, the second match. So. The first one, yeah, but with Cedric, that that was pretty good, too. I loved it when his eyes popped out. That was boing! It's like he hasn't seen a lollipop in a long time. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, um, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you, you next time. time. Bye! Bye.